I just, I just want to say that my co-counsel, Mary Ann Wong, I can only describe her argument in one word, and that is awesome, Stop. incredible. Stop. She made every important really? argument that she made on behalf of our client, Summer Zerbo. And we just want to say that no man is above the law, including the President of the United States. And we're just very proud of our, of Marianne. Do you feel confident? And I, I, and I want, and I think Summer wants to say something. Do you feel confident that you guys will have this case go to trial? We, we believe the court was very prepared and she asked excellent questions. So we believe, as she indicated, she'll be issuing a decision soon and we look forward to, to reading it. Ms. Service, how are you feeling? What would you do next? Would you depose the president? Would you depose other accusers? Yeah. Is there any way you'd tell us about yeah. that? We're not going to comment on what discovery we would be doing if we were permitted to proceed with our case. The first issue, the threshold issue, is whether or not uh, the court will grant uh, President Trump's motion uh, to dismiss this case or whether the court will permit Summer Zaravos' defamation lawsuit to proceed. There's also the possibility that it could be delayed right into his hands. Summer, how would you feel about that? That is, that is the argument the defendant is making. Okay. We think the, the judge was asking very good questions about that today. Ms. Zaravos, how do you feel and after Of course, our, our position is that this case should not be stayed for potentially seven years. Uh, until such time as uh, the president may leave office, that that would be prejudicial to our client. But in any case, that the burden is really on the president to state why there should be a stay, in other words, a delay of this case. Ms. Servos, how are you feeling after the argument? I think that's uh, I think that's all we have to say for today. We're going to wait the court's opinion. You have no sense of when that could be. She said she's going to go through all the cases. Uh, you would. Uh, I, this is she a very, very thoughtful uh, judge who has obviously read the president's motion to dismiss our opposition and then uh, the president's reply, and she was prepared and her questions reflected that. Uh, only she can state, only the court can state when the court will issue an opinion in this case. Thank you very Thank much. You,